Hi there. Um, this is the Helix Banjo. Uh, Larry was kind enough to send it to me to do some testing with and to uh, make some recordings with. And unfortunately, I slipped the disc in my back for the last month, two months, and I haven't been able to do anything. So, um, as a way to say thank you for being so patient with me, I decided to make a little video review of it. Um, the Helix Banjo Pot is the uh, the uh, the item in question here. Um, here, so you can see that the uh, pot is made up of um, seg. It's a block rim buildup. The um, the way that the buildup is is a little bit different. It's sort of hard to see the the the, uh, the way that he does it on an angle. Um, one of the really neat things about this is that the bit, the surface that the uh, coordinator rods bear on is flat as opposed to round. It's kind of nice. I think it's a it's a good thing. Uh, it wouldn't be something you could do if you were turning this on a lathe on the inside to keep uh, that flat, but because of the way that this is built up, uh, it works. Um, this is um, a hickory rim. Um, overall, I found it to be really nice. It's got a uh, just a rolled brass tone ring um, and the hardware that comes with it looks like it's standard banjo hardware. Nothing, nothing special, nothing bad, nothing bad about it at all. Um, I have been impressed with how loud the, uh, the Helix is. It, you know, Larry says that it's loud and it is. Um, so here's a little, uh, real nice, real sweet. Um, this is outfitted with one of his necks. Uh, there we go. Um, that he has uh, made for it. It's a nice neck. Um, it's just a good value in um, a banjo. I'm going to retune it and uh, give you a little up and down the neck kind of thing. So hold on a second. Okay, so um, got it retuned. Uh, I'm gonna do a little snowdrop because it's up and down the neck. It's nice. particularly hard or um, loud, um, but it does have a nice full tone. That's So it does sound nice um, and full uh, throughout the whole range of everything. Um, I'm going to pause and retune again and play another song. So hold on a sec. Alright, here we are. Out of open C into double C.
overall, I think it's really good value in a banjo. Um, you know, for someone who's looking for an American-made banjo uh, at an entry-level price point, this is really hard to beat. It's really nice. Uh, it's really solid. Um, I can't find too many things to niggle with about it and complain about. You know, there's a couple things about it that aren't the way that I like my banjo set up, but, you know, things like the bridge and um, that's about it. Other than that, I think it's a great banjo, and um, I thank Larry for lending it to me for so long, and I hope that um, this helps anybody out who's looking at the banjo. Thanks a lot. Bye-bye.